biker? No, a tiger. Yeah. Biker? No, a tiger. Oh, I see what you're doing. I hate the Apple AirPods. What up, though? I'm Fashan Vega, and this is Hate by Design. I'd like to welcome you to today's Tip Minute Tuesday. Today, we're gonna to talk about AirPods, AirPod 2s, and the things that I don't like about them. And we're also gonna take a look at a tip from my daughter, our sponsor, Avi Lodi. So, to get into it really quickly, the AirPod 2s have been anticipated and might be the most highly anticipated devices or things that come out in the last year. It's one of Apple's first products to not release right after the, the following year in quite some time, maybe ever. And it's a lot of speculation around if it's coming out and what the upgrades are gonna be. I have them. I use them daily. I swear by them. I hate the Apple AirPods. All right. With that said, I think everybody should have a pair. I think they're magic. I think the sound audio is fantastic. I think they pair easily. All the specs, you can go find any other YouTube channel that's showing how fantastic they are. What you don't see is a lot of channels talking about what's trash about them. And I'm gonna make a completely separate video about how horrible they are because they should be doing a few things that they don't. But that's why we're talking about the AirPods 2 and rumor has it, they will be doing those things. Those things being, being able to control the volume up and down being able to skip through songs or speed up or slow down songs, pause or play music without requesting Siri to do one of these performances for you. Meaning you can do all of your functions that you would need to do with your AirPods without making noise. If you're in a library, if you're somewhere quiet, if you're not able to speak to Siri and request a command, AirPods 2 and slight rumor AirPods 3 should or hopefully are able to do that. But to get into the tip today, if you have AirPods and if you plan on getting the AirPod 2s, this is a quick little tip and the best solution I've found on cleaning your AirPods. As awesome as AirPods or any in-ear headphone is, AirPods have something uniquely specific to them, which is they collect a lot of earwax from all of our ears. And a lot of people have came across noise reduction or sound quality reduction because of it and not knowing why. They'd rather return their AirPods, sold them, gave up on them, not realizing it was just because they were clogged up. The technology behind AirPods are actually pretty awesome. If you look into the AirPod, you can see right here that this second airway is not a speaker. It's a subwoofer. It allows the technology of the AirPod to suck air through here to create more bass to come through here and here. The science behind AirPods is actually really, really interesting. But as you might be able to see, mine is fairly clogged up. It's kind of gross a little bit. Yes, that's, that's 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 what's happening in my ear right now. But a little bit of peroxide, blow dryer, and a paper clip. Oh, we don't have a paper clip. Found it. Reason we need the paper clip is we're going to take the paper clip and we're going to scrape as much as we can out of here. So we're going to scrape all of that jungle matter out of here. Look at that. Yeah, that's what's hap that's what's been collected in my ear. Oh yeah, you got a lot to say about mine. Wait till you see what's in yours, my friend. Mm. You don't you wanna be gentle with this. Don't go hard. That's still mesh and it can be damaged. I also like to get this little bugger. Yep, because you see that? Little particles can come out of that. Once again, being sensitive. Look at that, that's crazy. All right, be gentle. I know it might look like I'm going rough, but I'm being really sensitive not to get in there. So these are all things that's blocking air to pass through the device. And we don't want that. So what I do now, is take the blow dryer and try to warm up any wax that got behind the screen and the peroxide should get it out. 
Gonna take some peroxide, put a little dab in that container. Q-tip, soak that up. I'm going to clean upside down. I don't want anything dripping in here. It doesn't have to be. See that, getting that out. My next movement, blow, again. Blow dryer. And I hit it one more time for good measure for anything that may still have been in there that had not been removed. And with that, I should be done. The reason I have the wipe, I like to use the wipes to give the AirPods one last good clean over. And we're done. Hopefully this helps you. If it does, please leave a comment below. If it doesn't, please leave a comment below. And I'd love to learn why. Uh, maybe I can help. Maybe I need to get some help. If you have a better way of doing this, please share that below too. I'm really interested. This is just what I found to work so far. And with that, I think it's time to go see Avi Lodi. It's a buyer, how did you know? <laughs> <laughs> um, just walking around to go fish teeth. design on your hat. Hi guys, my name is Avi and today's tip number Tuesday is about listening. Listening is good because you can see what people are saying clearly and also know what is happening. If you don't listen pay and pay attention, then you don't know what's going on and you might not be able to follow directions or know what to do. Both of are very important. For children, because if you're in school and you're listening, it can help you get good grades. Also know what's going on. You can see, well, here, if anything's about you or if you need to pay attention to it. It is more important to be listening to people because it is respect. And in all, listen to learn, listen to help, listen to care. These are three great tips to start 2019 and even for school. See you next year. In all, quick recap, the Apple AirPods come with some issues. It makes me very irritated. It's still extremely worth it. If you're thinking about getting them, do so. Uh, we still don't have an official release date on the AirPod 2s, but they are coming. And even though the rumors haven't been all confirmed yet, I think it's still gonna be worth it. Wireless charging and some of the upgrades, like having some new functionality, like being able to control volume, audio, through just touching the AirPods. And hey Siri will be hands off. Those are all cool things that we can look forward to. I hope they do more than that, but we'll see. But no matter if you have the AirPods first gen, or you're going to two, or even three, cleaning them is gonna be necessary. They're going to collect wax buildup, and it's going to muffle the audio quality. They're not broken, they're just clogged up. Just clean the speakers, be sensitive, and you should have full quality back into your AirPods. My daughter, Avi Lodi, gave us a really quick and solid tip today. Listen to learn, listen to help, and listen to care. That is fantastic advice to start off your 2019. With that said, it's looking about that time and I'd like to thank you for yours. Happy, happy, successful, great, fantastic new year. And here's the 20 hype team. If this video helps you out at all, please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. Design is a basic human need and a basic human right. So lead strong, be now, think great, and as always, define, design, repeat. Don't forget, follow everybody in Decoy. That's Detroit conglomerate of YouTubers. It's where you go to learn about everything Detroit on YouTube from Detroiters themselves.